So you're looking to buy a new home and you're wondering just how far will your money go or what kind of home will buy you between the prices of $500,000 and $750,000 in Bentonville. Well, my friend, today I'm going to show you three different homes in different styles in different parts of town and I'll show you exactly how far your dollar will go. There's typically two kinds of people that reach out to me when they're looking to move here. Ones that are realistic and ones that are unrealistic. The unrealistic ones I hear are, hey Anthony, I've got a budget of $200,000, I'm looking for 15 acres, a 6,000 square foot house with a pool. And I'm going, hey look, Arkansas is cheap to live in, but we need to talk about your budget. And then there's the other kind of individual who doesn't realize that in their market, they may be able to buy a five bed, four bath, three car garage for 800,000, we might be able to find that here in Bentonville for around six or 700,000. Before we head out and look at pretty houses, I have one simple request. If you're thinking about moving to Northwest Arkansas, see this number right here? Would you give me a call? It would be my honor to help serve you in your move here to Northwest Arkansas. Okay, let's go check out some houses. 900 Clark Circle here in Bentonville, Arkansas. Actually, we're just into Centerton with a Bentonville address and Bentonville schools. This four bed, three bath, three car garage home was just listed at the shooting of this video. Let's go ahead and go on inside and check it out. You'll notice crown molding. You'll notice very modern features throughout the home. This is a one story home, very well laid out with a split floor plan with the primary bedroom being on one side with the other guest bedrooms being on the opposite side. The home features granite countertops, gas fireplace. Something else that this home offers outside of other homes you might see in the area is its own separate office space or you could use it as a dining room. At the time of filming, the home was listed at $525,000. Notice how the home is very well decorated with accent colors of blue and copper. Landmark Construction did a phenomenal job picking out all of the colors of this home. The home was built in 2019, offers 2550 square feet, and again is a single story home. Fully fenced in backyard, the neighborhood offers its own community amenities with playground, basketball court, and its own swimming pool. It's my understanding that the neighbors in Creekside are often seen out walking and or kids playing throughout the neighborhood. This home is served by Creekside Middle School, Osage Elementary, Fulbright Junior High, as well as Bentonville West High School. The home has three full bathrooms. Let's go ahead and check out the primary bath. Wide open space in the primary bathroom, dual sinks, and a large walk-in closet. Frigidaire gallery stainless steel appliances are all included. Notice the six burner gas stove in the lovely open kitchen. Washer and dryer can be included with acceptable offer. Come on into 2308 Northeast Steinbeck Drive here in Gramercy Park neighborhood on the northeast side of Bentonville. Let's go take a look around this new construction home. This home offers five bed, four and a half bathrooms with over 3,480 square feet. As mentioned earlier, we're on the northeast side of Bentonville with a stunning view out the front door. As you're seeing here is the two-story entryway and foyer welcoming guests into the home. Ten-foot ceilings are in the main part of the house, but as you can see, it continues. As we're here in the living room with the beautiful fireplace and two-story living room space, natural light is being flooded in everywhere. As it says in the listing description, the Eden kitchen is a chef's dream with its oversized island, quartz countertops, walk-in pantry, gas range, and beautiful backsplash. Let's go check out upstairs. We're here on the second floor, which is kind of the hub of the whole second floor. 
We have four bedrooms up, including the primary suite. Let's go check that out now. Wow. Phenomenal views out this window. The primary suite offers two closets for you. Dual sinks with a powder table and taller cabinets. Not to mention a gorgeous soaker tub. Ceramic tile all through the first floor with a wood look finish. All through the first floor and here in the second floor foyer as well. Once you go into the bedrooms, those are carpeted. Now that we've had a chance to check out the top floor and the main floor, let's go down to the basement. Now down in the lower level, this room that I'm standing in right now could be used as a flex room, a play room, could be used as a lower level family room. There is a bedroom down here, as well as the laundry room and a workout space. You'll notice the same flooring in the basement as throughout the top and main floor. Lower level bathroom is a full bathroom, so this could be a junior suite for someone down in this level of the house even in the basement, still is offering crown molding as well as 10-foot ceilings, so it doesn't feel like a lower-level basement. Outside of your front door is one of the most gorgeous views I have ever seen of Northwest Arkansas. Unbeknownst to many who might not know is Handcut Hollow, which is one of Bentonville's up-and-coming mountain bike trails, are just through the woods that you're seeing now. Gramercy Park offers its residents their own pool, as well as being tucked up here away in the northeast corner of Bentonville, you're still zoned in the award-winning Bentonville School District. Just imagine all of the memories you could create here on the back deck when it's not raining. A quick disclaimer before we check out the third house is, depending on when you're watching this, please understand that home prices will continue to fluctuate. So the prices that you're seeing today might be different than two years from now whenever you're watching this video. We are here at 3509 Southwest Awakening in Aurora neighborhood on the southwest side of Bentonville. I'm sitting here with Liz and Ashley with Sapphire Homes. Thank you ladies for having us here today. Well, thank, thank you. you. Absolutely, absolutely. If you would, kind of give us an idea. What's the home that we're sitting in today? So this home is one of our modern garden homes here in Aurora in the Harmony section. And they are high-end luxury garden homes that are purely brick. So you say luxury homes. Tell me a little bit more what makes the home luxury. So these homes, not only are they luxury because they're a garden home, we have put a lot of thought into them, whether it's the 12 foot ceilings, the oversized windows, but we've packed a lot of detail into a very small space. So if you would tell me what are some of the amenities here inside of Aurora? Yeah, we have plenty of amenities. So Aurora is really cool. There's three separate neighborhoods within Aurora. Halo, Horizon, and Harmony. They're all going to have the same amenities with pools, parks, pavilions, some sports courts, and they all get to use it. Harmony is its own pocket neighborhood, so it has its own private common space, okay. which the HOA will be able to take care of the front irrigation system and the flower beds. So again, Low lock and leave yeah. and yeah, go. What are we, like 10 minutes from the airport here? Yeah, yeah. yeah. super Very close to really every close. event. Close, convenient. Let's go take a look at the house. Yeah. Let's laugh. Absolutely. So we start here in this grand entry. You have the 12 foot ceilings when you walk in, which makes your guests come in and feel like, oh my gosh, this is a massive home for mm -hmm. the small amount of square footage, right. right? And so you come in, you have your art nook, and then you come in off your main living area, you have your separate suite. Mm -hmm. So you still feel closed off from everything over. You have your primary suite with your bath and your massive desk area and oversized closet. As you can see, Sapphire Homes very much values natural light. Mm -hmm. So we do oversized windows every place we can get. Yeah, absolutely. The, the windows bringing in all that light absolutely fills the room same flooring all throughout the whole house, right? Yes. Okay. 
So we actually have two separate closet spaces and we give our owners the opportunity to either have a desk or two closets. So right now we have this outfitted as a desk okay. office space. Nice. So they still keep their area over in their suite and keep all of their office space if they're, you know, if they're retired or they would like to work from home, we can keep this, close the door and keep the mess away. Your massive primary bath and oversized closet. Oh wow. Yes. So you still feel like you're at a spa. It's luxury and a 2,200 square foot home. You still have space. You can play baseball in here. You can do <laughs> yoga, you can play baseball. Quartz countertops throughout, and then all of our cabinetry have your soft close option, so Love we it. still bring in the luxury. A lot of people are looking for the dovetailing of. Right. And another thing that we always, always do is tile is always to the ceiling. So yeah. build time. Let's say somebody were to come today and they said, all right, I want to buy one of these on this lot. What are you looking at as far as start to finish? Right now we're looking at around six to nine months. So we're back in the kitchen. Yes. Tell us a little bit about the appliances and, and again, part of that luxury that you guys are providing. I can tell right away without asking, these aren't your standard run of the mill. No, they definitely aren't. So one of our favorite lines is the GE Cafe line. They have that finishing touch that you get on the handles, the knobs, very high-end finishes, but also they work amazing. You get what you pay for, and GE Cafe is one of our favorites. And like you were saying, actually, this this is all standard, but you buy in the home right yes. as is. Yes. Now, you can do some upgrades, probably, but it's already starting out at higher end than what you might see in other builders do. When your clients are coming in and they're wanting to come and contract with you, mm -hmm. do you have a design center or a place close by that you bring people in and show them what their options are? Yes, so actually right next door is our model home for Harmony. And so they get to see a lot of our product in there, whether it's some of our other flooring or quartz samples or hardware. So we try to outfit a lot of these homes and most of the stuff that we're going to use in our packages so people can come in and see it. And if not, we, we will take them to the store and say, hey, let's go and we'll show you exactly what's going to go in this home. Although this may look like a model home, that's next door, like Ashley was saying. But this one is available for purchase right now. What is the price of this one? This one comes in at six nineteen nine. For oh my goodness, you guys better come check this house out. Thank you, Liz and Ashley, so much for letting us come through the home today, and of course, tell you right being here as well. Everything you've done. Absolutely. Of course, thank you. I don't know about you, but I had a good time checking out those three properties for you. If again, one of these properties is something you might be interested of, my number is down in the comments below and or feel free to reach out to me. Maybe Bentonville is not your best city, but now you know a little bit more of what life is like in and around Bentonville. Thanks for watching.